Hey, what is up, guys? This is Corb, and welcome to Mission Timna. Let's do this, man. An expedition to Sinai. 2,000 population requirement, kingdom rating of 17, prosperity of 15. Should be easy enough for a professional like us, you know what I'm saying? Let's do this, boys. Okay, man. Can't actually remember what this mission is, but given that it's a kingdom rating requirement, a victory condition, makes me think that we're going to be fulfilling deliveries to the capital. Let's see, shall we? A new, new pharaoh, Den, has taken the throne of Egypt. Let's have a look around. Deeply concerned as enemies have begun to threaten our borders, and our nation lacks adequate supplies of valuable copper needed to create weapons with which to equip our troops. Pharaoh okay. Den has ordered a mining expedition into the unforgiving land of Sinai, oh. beyond our borders and deep within Bedouin territory. The area known as Timna is rich in gold and copper ore. Okay, all right. Oh my god, actually, it's the first military mission. Okay, yeah. All right, all right, all right, all right. I know this, boys. I know this. So up here in the top right, we have the copper mines. We can mine a bunch of stuff from here. Gold, gems, copper, I believe. Down here is the nearest place where we can place housing. So I guess we'll do that. Food. Looks like hunting is going to be on the cards. Very lovely. And yeah, we have to complete like a bunch of shipments to the capital. So whenever the pharaoh asks for something, we need to send him stuff. Okay. Simple enough. We got this right. It's the worst that can happen. All right, man. Let me just get the groundworks laid for our little city here. Our little living quarters. So let's pause real quick. All right, I think that will do for a little jump start. I think that this uh, strategy worked really, really good in the last episode that we did, so we might as well resume it now, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, we got our bazaars and our uh, water supplies and a couple of shrines and stuff and all of the basic amenities that people are going to need very early on. At the end of little walkways, at the end of little alcoves, man, so as soon as the bazaar traders leave the bazaars, they're going to toddle on down this path. Very lovely. Feed everybody as they go. And everybody's gonna be grand. Okay, so next up we need to sort food, which luckily for this map, very, very simple. Basically a crap load of hunting lodges. Um, I am gonna need an anti-fire blah 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 over here. Which is all grand. Um, and granaries too. Okay. We probably won't need many granaries for this, to be honest. So I'm just going to knock up a couple and uh, get some little access roads drawn here as well. So it goes all the way over. And I guess we're going to need an architect's post here as well, right? Just so we don't have any stupid collapses. Our hunters are going out to annihilate these goddamn ostriches. Absolutely one shot a dude. Wrecked. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um... So just very, very quickly, I do also need to get the pottery section set up as well. It's pretty important, to be honest, to make sure that we get, uh, like, reasonable upgrades going to the houses early on. And then we must start mining over here, man, because, well, you know, the Pharaoh is a damn needy bastard. And we're going to need to be ready to go as soon as he needs to start sending him stuff. Because apparently he can't fucking do it himself. But okay. My, uh, sorry, clear pit, clear pit, and clear pit here. Very nice. Uh, path over this way. Guess I want a little stop blocker here as well. Stop people wandering off. I'm getting pretty good, man, at using these little roadblocks, I think. Oh, I haven't released any of the episodes yet, so maybe you guys are raging at me for being bad at using them, and I just don't know it yet. But I think I'm doing okay. <laughs> At least this far, you know? We're doing alright, man. Okay. Uh, except none. Let's do what we always do here. Half pottery. And half clay. That's the fella. That's the lad. That's the Chad. And let's get the potter set up as well, man. I'm not gonna go like crazy overboard with these. Like I have done in previous episodes that came. We are going to need firehouse here. We're also going to need a uh, architect's post. Make sure this shit ain't collapsing on us. Oh yeah, we should also probably throw a festival for Seth. Seeing as he doesn't seem like the kind of god that would be uh, 
Should be wise. It wouldn't be very wise to annoy Seth. You know what I'm saying? The god of death and war and the underworld and all that stuff He's in this game. As far as this game's concerned, that's what his mechanics do, man. And we're going to be needing him later on to help our military buildings get some value. Okay, so anyways, man. We're building up nicely. Food's coming in. These are going to upgrade just okay, I think. Uh, entertainment. I suppose I should take care of this nice and early as well. I suppose. Juggling school. Oh god, look at our look at our cash actually. No, 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 no. You know what? Undo that. I just realized we're gonna go into debt here immediately. <laughs> I'm so fucking terrible, dude. Okay, man. Yes, yes, yes. There's our emergency fund, I know. We need gold, man. We need gold. Dude, can all these like notifications get off my goddamn screen? Gold first and foremost, man. Gold first and foremost. Should have did this right away, really, but... Oh, there you go. How are we doing for employees, man? Okay, people are still moving in, so we should be okay. There we go, yeah. We're about to go into positive now, right? We're about to go into positive now, right? Surely, dude. Oh. Okay. Well, I think we're okay. Nice. People are working in the mines. Pack down that gold, boys. We'll be doing grand in no time. Uh, I gotta save some spots for, like, gemstone mines and stuff. I don't really want a path all the way around here. Unless I do. Unless I do. It would be really expensive to path all the way around here. Oh, what am I doing? I haven't even, I haven't even built roads to this man. I'm sat here yapping. Let's do that first. We have 11% unemployment now, so that's good. That's actually a good thing right now. Get this crap sorted. Get that thing knocked out there. Oh, we don't even have a temple to Seth. Oh my god. Okay, he still likes us though. That's good. Um, Yeah, I built lots of shrines to Seth, but no uh, temples. Sorry, Seth. My bad, bro. <laughs> Won't happen again. We'll get one there and one here, I guess. There we go, man. Seth's good people, man. Seth's good people. He'll be alright. <laughs> I hope. Okay. Cool. We are farming gold. That's going to start to replenish our treasury a little bit. Yes, I know, I know. He's all sad because he has to wield the gold so far to the palace, but like, this is literally the closest I can build the palace. I don't have a choice, okay? I don't make these fucking maps. What do you think, I'm God? For God's sake. Um, yeah, I'm not going to mine all the way around this side as well, I don't think. I'm just not sure it's that worth it, man. I'm just not sure it's that necessary. It'll cost us so much to get over, though. We should build one gemstone mine really quickly. Just because sometimes the pharaoh can request um, gemstones. Which are... Where exactly, dude? Oh, there they are. I'm just blind. He can request that shit, so, yeah. I just want to be ready. Just in case that shit comes down the pipeline. And now let's set up, I guess, a couple of copper mines. I kind of like my gold mines too, though, man. Because the, uh, the, the Pharaoh can also request gold too, you know? So maybe this is just fine. Get into the storage yard in here. Um, except none apart from copper. We can use this to store a copy here, man. Okay. Now we just speed up the game a bunch. We should be alright for a while, man. You still haven't received any food. Look, look! The Pharaoh's already requesting copper, man. Goddamn SOB, dude. Oh, you want connection to the road? There it is. Okay, we'll have that copper in no time, man. We'll have the copper in no time. Seth vows to protect any of our soldiers sent to battle in far-off lands. Okay, there we go. We're making cash now. Well done, boys. I have to go clear across the city with these goods. It'll take all day. Well, life's hard, man. Get used to it. Okay, ain't getting easier. Oh, man. Dude, I don't know why I'm such tired in these games, dude. Like, whenever I play Stellaris, man, 
I can build like any kind of spacefaring empire I could ever dream of. And I always just build like the most despotic slaver empire, <laughs> you know? It's like absolutely terrible. Oh, I don't know. Not good, man. Oh, fuck. I shouldn't have built it on that side, but ah, fuck it. It's not that big of a deal, but it's just because now I will have to build a firehouse on this side of the shit as well. You know what I'm saying? Get a new roadblock in there. So that firehouse is literally just guarding those guys, you know? Okay, man. Nice. Granary's filling up okay. I think we have enough hunting lodges here. The food supply looks alright. What's holding you guys back? Okay, it's beautification again. Beautification's always the bloody problem. So I tell you what, we'll drop this house and we'll drop this house. And we'll beautify here in the middle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know. Oh, wait. I can't deliver it though. What are you talking about? I only have 300 copper. Oh, yeah. Okay, I can't click it. All I can do is acknowledge for now. But we'll have that copper man in no time, dude. Oh, look at these beautiful statues, dude. You still haven't received food? How is that possible? How is that po- Oh my god. Okay. The unemployment's starting to get a little bit ludicrous. Let's build some tax collector's offices. Connect that guy with a path. Very good, very good. Big old entertainment section here, man. Bam. The pavilion is down. I repeat. The pavilion is down. Maybe we get a bandstand here too. Look at the pavilion go, dude. Look at those sultry dancers. I mean, dude, who needs like modern technology, man? You don't have any access to local religious facilities. You having a joke? You having a laugh? He's having a goddamn egg yolk. Oh. Oh, are you evolving or not? Oh yeah, I should probably throw Seth into the festival, actually. So you're a little bit low on gold still now, but it doesn't really matter so much. Oh, hang on, I can I can fulfill that order, can't I now? Um, political overseer. Bam. There you go, man. Take the copper, man. Take it. Oh, do I build a path all the way around here? To get to the other gold? That's such a long way, dude. Oh, no! Oh, I'm such a fool! I didn't realize, of course it's better to build the palace here. So it's really close to the gold mines. And then you have your living arrangement down here. Oh. Well, we've done it now, boys. <laughs> it's too late now. Too late now, you know what I'm saying? Nothing to be done about it. Okay. Oh, plaza. Oh my god, that put us into debt. <laughs> but it's all good. Everybody's evolving now, man. Which is actually bad news. Because we don't really have the, like... Well, we have so much unemployment right now. You know, I'm just gonna start building some military buildings. Just right now, I think. Uh, This costs a thousand, though. Oh my god. Okay, well, we can at least build the recruiter here. I don't even know if it needs to be attached to the road, actually. Does it? Or does it not? Well, we'll just whack it here next to the granaries for now. Okay, the pottery's coming out all right. I think everything's going okay so far. I don't know what's wrong with you fools. Or you still think that you don't have access to any religious facilities. That's cute, man. Whack one there, then. Yeah, I gotta work on my temple placement a little bit because, yeah, this housing system works really good for distributing, like, bizarre goods. But it's not great for... Like, you're just relying on RNG, but the priest is gonna walk down these little lanes. Oh, there we go, look. Here goes the priest guy now, upgrading everything. Like, everything he walks past is getting upgraded because... Oh, nice! We have, a, we have a local priest now, dude. Hang on, why can't you upgrade? Things get stuck for no reason. I swear. There you go, there's some gardens, man. What's wrong with you? 
Tell you what's wrong with you. Boom, you're homeless. That's what's fucking wrong with you, dude. Sorted. That's how we handle that, man. <laughs> Don't like it in my civilization? Well, there's the desert. Off you go, dude. <laughs> oh, man. Dude, I'm, 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 I'm such a terrible person in these games. But hey, it's all part of the fun of it. So we do need to start manufacturing some weapons because the Pharaoh can also ask for weapons too. So we want to be ready for that. So I'm just going to move the roadblock down a little bit. And we can build the weaponsmith. Ooh, nice. Right here. Um, and we should also get... Uh, we're also going to need fire protection here now as well. Yes, yes, yes. We're briefly in debt again. I know. It's all good. Um, do I build two weaponsmiths? I guess I do, man. Okay, so the recruiter is up and running. What's our unemployment? Like, 33 fucking percent? Oh my god. Like, I'm just building one or two lanes too many in housing. Because, like, our population isn't that crazy, but it's just... It's just, man, I can't... I can't hire all these people! Um... Wait a minute. I could maybe open up some trade routes, right? See you on the world map. Ooh. You buy excess copper. Interesting, interesting. What about you? You buy papyrus. Okay, I don't really have access to reeds, or do I? Are there any reeds on this map that I can harvest and sell? No, I don't even have the building for it. Okay, well, what else can we import, man? Okay, we can... Oh, fuck. We can basically just buy beer. That's it. Yeah. So, like, these trade routes are literally useless. I think they're completely worthless to us. The thinnest. This one could be good. Once I can afford it, anyway. Once we're out of debt. Okay. Let's speed the game up, man. Let the little gold farmers do their thing. Um, We can get attacked on this level, so we are going to have to get some kind of military up and running soon. God's sake, man. Do I really need to build another statue for you fools? I've already built that one. There you go, man. Go. Upgrade. Yeah, they're not going to upgrade anymore unless they've got beer. Which I don't know if I can actually provide, man. Oh my god. The unemployment is like 40%, man. That is ridiculous. That is actually absurd. Okay, I don't want to fall into debt anymore, though, dude. So I'm just going to wait a little until I can buy some Fort Arches without spending anything. Uh, without going into debt, I mean, without going into minus figures. Because it costs a thousand, men to start arming a Fort of Arches. There we go. Oh, you want my copper? Okay, he just wants copper. God, I thought he wanted gold there for a second. I was about like, you son of a bitch. You wait until I got a thousand? <laughs> okay, never mind. He wants the copper, man. Bam. Sorted. Done. Fort Ashes. Okay, the good thing about forts is that they actually just don't need road access. Um, you can literally just put them anywhere. So that's good. Put that down. These recruiters now start producing uh, units here. Little bar filling up feels grand. So we'll have something of like a standing army. We'll have like a defense force. Well, why are you guys... You've lost access to religious facilities. Yeah. No, you haven't though, have you? Like... They're right there and right there, you know? Do I just need fucking temples everywhere? I tell you what, man. This is how you combat goddamn unemployment right here, right? Watch this, man. This is a masterclass. Ugh! <laughs> Can we possibly have more temples? No, we can't. Um, I will fill this in again, I suppose. Little shrine there, dude. Kingdom standing climbs. Very lovely. Let me see our overseers, man. Uh, ratings overseer. Our political standing is already, like, really good. Look at that. We're starting to get little arches in our fort now. Very lovely. So, unfortunately, um, I'm not sure what I think of the change, to be honest, but the old Pharaoh game 
allow you to actually take your units out of the fort. You could control them in like a mini RTS style, like combat kind of thing. You're like, people would invade you on your lands and you'd send your guys in and they'd like right click them, you know, and pew pew them. It wasn't very good. I mean, it wasn't like fucking StarCraft over here, you know? Oh my god. Okay, the thievery in the tax collector's offices has begun. Dude, I removed so many houses and we still have so much unemployment. It's just ridiculous. It's actually ridiculous, dude. Um. Oh, balls. But yeah, now in this version of Pharaoh, um, the battles are just like auto-resolve, pretty much. Like, you get, like, a little animation that shows you how big their army is and how big yours is, and they match together and blah, blah, blah. But you don't, like, control anything. It all just sort of happens, you know? Uh, which I don't really know what I think about it, but... Okay, um, anyways. We have to just, like, create jobs. We have to fabricate jobs right now. Couple of bobby stations here, man. Get the pigs. Get the pigs in. Uh, drop another one here. Couple up there, I guess. I don't know, dude. I'm just, I'm just making anything now. Uh, get the courthouse down, because I mean, why not? And tax collector's office. Another one can fit there, because I don't know. Maybe we need it. Okay, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Robin courthouses, man, because like there's just no fucking jobs. No, I can see my cash going down, man. Stop it. Can I just like use the military on them? <laughs> okay. I'll speed things up a whole bunch, man. Yes, 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 yes. I just need to get to a thousand cash and then I can fucking hire some of you as military clowns. I'm just gonna conscript them to the military, man. There you go. Okay, recruit them quickly. These thieving bastards. Look at all these beautiful houses they live in, man. It's all because of me. How do they repair me? Thieving. Flats, man. Fuckers. Shitters. For God's sake! What can I build that occupies these fools? There's no point building anything else. I'm just wasting time. Personal mansion. Yes. They can come and save me. Fuck. Uh. Sure, that'll do. I'm just gonna build things, man. I don't know, like. Blah, blah, blah. Yep, yep, yep. People still stealing shit. I get it. Oh my god, I just heard somebody literally die. That means that a police officer fucking caught someone and just beat them to death. Craziness. Okay, still 23%? Like, dude. Dude, I'm gonna build another recruit, man. How many people does this hire? 10. It's not a huge amount, but... Oh, I can only make one! For God's sake! Okay, fine. Uh, luckily, Seth just fucking loves us, by the way. Okay, so I've got too many gemstone mines here, man. Oh no, I only have one! Yeah, that's perfect then. I should only have one. sick man do i do i build all the way around here uh man he wants a lot of bloody weapons he wants a lot of weapons oh my god okay tell you what i'm gonna fucking do dude actually what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna do it man i'm just gonna do this shit better lit than never and all that right let's build copper mines everywhere man yeah, 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 we're in debt, I get it. Believe it or not, I'm used to being here, man. This is nothing new, okay? Copper mines down. Now, I don't want to stay in debt for too long, obviously, but... I'm going to need a storage yard over here, too, though. Uh, let's produce it right there. And we need to do only accept copper. And then as soon as I have enough cash to open up that trade route, I can start just selling copper like crazy, because I should have loads coming in then. That's the plan, man. That's the plan. 15% unemployment now, that's not that bad. That's not that bad, man. Not too shabby. 
Okay, how much did the trade route cost? We should be able to afford it in a sec. Okay, that should be enough, right? 800. Hang on, this was the one, right? Yeah, you buy copper. Okay, dude, where is it? Export went over, let's say... 1200? Surely the Pharaoh won't ask for more than 1200. Surely not. Oh! There's an army attack incoming. Okay. Well, I do have some units ready. I can't equip them with shields because I don't have access to hides on this map. So they're just like little spearmen. Training very, very, uh... That's some expert training right there, dude. <laughs> what the fuck? You're like a fucking demon hunter in WoW, dude. Okay, man. Alright, anyways, yeah, we should start selling surplus copper now, which is going to help us out a lot. Uh, I suppose I'll just keep on building mines as I can, like, as and when I can afford them. Well, that was a terrible fucking decision to build that there, right? Oh. Okay. That'll do. Fuck it. More mines. So the reason, yeah, I'm not building more gold mines here is because this travel time all the way through all these paths and then all the way to the palace is just horrible. Like, it will take them so long to get there with the gold that they're mining that it's just not worth it. But I, man. I. So the reason the copper's not building up very well here as well is because we have so many weaponsmiths that are using the copper to make uh, all these tools here. Because the weapon, uh, the, the pharaoh does like his tools, man. Whoops. Yeah, yeah, look at the sea, man, sea. Okay, yeah, I acknowledge that shit, man. Just... Dude, can we just, like, not be producing fucking... Speeman for just a second? I tell you what, man. I need to, uh, actually... Get all... I need to give it priority. Why are people still robbing tax collector's offices, man? Get a job! Get a job! Okay. Why are you still taking weapons to the bloody... Stop taking weapons from the storage yard, man. Dude! Why are people robbing my shit? It's like 6% unemployment, what is this? It's like my fucking hometown in here. Police! I've had enough! Oh, that has no bloody road access. Fucking bobby stations everywhere, man. Stop them. Okay. Dude, can I, like, stop this building for just a second, man? How do I... St I don't want to, like, destroy it. Oh, God. I'm nervous, man. We might not make the shipment in time, dude. Where are you guys go going? Clear across the city with these goods. Why? It'll take all day. Why do you have to go clear across the city with those goods? Oh, because you're delivering them to the weaponsmiths. Okay. Oh. The Bedouin army will be here in six months. Okay, man. Dude, I'm just gonna make more fucking weaponsmiths in a minute. And I tell you what, I might just start replacing the gold mines even. With copper mines. At least like one at a time anyway. Because like copper mines are actually just more valuable right now. Oh. Alright, dude. Yeah, I don't know if we can stockpile weapons quickly enough to uh, make the shipment to the bloody Emperor in time. I keep calling him fucking Emperor, man. Okay, we have 11 out of 15. We only have two months to comply, though. <gasps> A bunch just went in. Maybe we can do it. Oh. Dude. Don't take them. Don't take them. Okay, nice. I thought he was going to the... Uh, we can do this, man. Come on, weaponsmiths. 
You almost done? You almost done? You almost done? You're almost done! High low, sell high. That's my motto. Okay, yep, lovely. Okay, here comes more weapons, man. We might have enough just now. How is, how is it gone down? Oh. I know, I know, Pharaoh, I'm trying, bro. I have one month to do this. You nearly done? You're nearly done. What about you? Okay, you're, you're literally done. Here comes some spears. Plonk. One more. Here it comes. Plonk. Okay. Did we do it? We, we, we did it, right? Yes. Okay. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Here comes the trader to buy our copper, man. Oh. Watch our, ca watch our cash here, man. We're at like 3,000 right now. Oh! 1.7k, man. That's the power of trade right there, dude. The power of trade. I'll tell you what I'm going to do, man. I'll tell you what I'm going to do, dude. I'm going to go ahead and build me a happy little storage yard. And we're going to actually start to uh, import a bit of beer now, I think. Hang on. Ooh. Can I import barley? Trade route to ex export? Like, what's the point of that? Does anybody sell barley? Anybody? Game meat? No, like, nobody sells barley, dude. So I just have to import the beer, I guess. That's expensive, man. I'd rather import the raw material and make it myself, but... Oh, well. This will have to do, I guess. Okay, import to maintain. That's, uh, like, 600, man. I'd say, like, 800. There we go. That'll help all of our housing keep on upgrading, because these guys need beer to upgrade, man. They've had enough. They're not lifting a finger. What? What do you mean I delayed it? What do you mean? I fucking delivered the bloody weapons that he asked for. Like, a month before the deadline. If the deadline is late, then why did he make it the fucking deadline, dude? Kingdom standing falls my ass, man. I don't mean a recount. No! Dude, the pharaoh is a dick. Don't tell him I said that. I'm gonna get in trouble. Okay, man, let's build some, let's build some more forts, man. Let's keep the recruiters working, man. Keep the recruiters busy. Bucket, put more arches too, I guess. Because we might as well. So the battle's about to happen. So Seth remembers his promise to protect you and his delight to slay those who are foolish enough to threaten your city. Yeah, but does he actually do that? Because look, man, I'm going to go to the battle now. And like, this is all that happens, dude. I mean... First of all, your infantry don't even clash with each other. They just walk past each other. And like, I can't control anything here, you know? Click, drag, shift, click. Right click, like, I can't do shit. And like, no one dies ever. You just have to click continue. And then it tells you what happened. <laughs> like, I don't know, man. I don't know if I'm just being nostalgic and I just miss the old battle system where you could actually micro your guys. Uh, but, I don't know, man. Like, maybe this is better once you've been playing for like 300 hours or something. And it's like, you just don't want to fucking deal with that shit anymore. And you just kind of skip through the battles, but... So we lost one archer somehow. Oh well. He died he died bravely, man. That's all that matters. Okay. So uh yeah, what are my objectives? Oh, that's the encyclopedia. What are my objectives? That's in game help. What are my objectives? Two thousand pop. Okay. Two thousand pop? Dude, that's quite a lot, man. That's quite that's quite a lot, man. Better an army will be here again. Okay, yep, lovely. Hold the festival for Seth, because he's earned it. He's a good lad. He's an absolute chad of a deity. What can I say? I guess I've just got to build, like, an extra little housing area over here, but I'm not going to take it that seriously, to be honest. Could just be, like, a little peasant establishment or something. But I do have to, like, boost my uh, population by quite a bit. A bit more than I was expecting, so... I guess we just do this... 
Uh, what am I looking at? Bizarre. Okay, religion. Into the Dagon Temple, I guess. Um, maybe here? We just build houses, like, all over this way. Maybe even some around here, too, man. Okay. Just fill houses in everywhere where there aren't houses, pretty much, right now. No road access. Oh, okay. Well, they'll just despawn. It's all good. At least they did in the old version of the game. I hope that they do. Yes, look at how much pottery you got, dude. It's nutty. No, why are you guys... Oh, you're, you're evolving. Oh, it's because we got beer, man. Yes. Okay, I tell you what. I'm going to let these guys accept uh, flax as well. Is what I'm going to do. And I'm going to start importing some flax, man. Because flax is actually useful. Oh, wait a minute. Is it flax? No, it's not. Flax is for linen. No! No! How does nobody sell reeds? Nobody sells papyrus either? Oh, for God's sake. Okay, so yeah, I can't actually upgrade my, uh, my buildings anymore, man. The best thing I can do now is create jobs. Um... So I guess we'll just make another military fort. Another archer fort here. That'll create more jobs, right? You can't go wrong with tax collectors, too. Yes, yes, yes. Bedouin army will be here soon. Lovely. Our tax collector's office. We already have the courthouse down, so that's good. I think we're pretty much good here. Guess I'll build like another emergency architect certain stuff, but we just need to encourage immigration, that's all, man. Yeah, employees need it, but we have we have space in these houses because they've just upgraded to fit more people in them. Like the more upgraded your house are, the more occupants they can have. So we should be able to get people to migrate pretty easily. I think. I really hope, anyway. I don't see where they're coming from, man. If people are migrating, I don't see where they're coming from, dude. But Got extra room for like a billion people in these houses, man. Okay. Um, let's beautify a little bit. Because we have the cash. Oh my god, that lag lags my fucking game, dude, when I drag this. Um, oops. A couple of little gardens there. Very lovely. Why are you devolving? What do you think that you th you think that you don't have access to a bloody physician? Are you mental? There's something wrong with you, dude. You need more than a damn physician. Fine. We'll put another one down over there. I mean, I don't know if it's gonna help those guys that much, but. I don't really know what I'm supposed to do. Goddamn clowns. Okay. So when are these houses going to get occupied, man? I don't know why it takes so long for migrants to arrive sometimes. Like, we need employees. We have room in these houses for more people. And we have empty spots. But we're just not... You know what I mean? We, we Like, we're just not creating any... I don't know, man. Okay, set is gonna look after us. I mean, we have like a pretty. Oh, there we go, man. Migrants coming. Grand. All of these houses are devolving for some reason because they think they don't have access to a fucking magistrate. A goddamn courthouse. Fine. Oh, no, this is a tax collector's office. Oh, no, I can't build it there, can I? Okay. This goddamn tax collector's office is actually a problem. Like, the path should just go up here like this. There. And there. That is how we do it. Okay. 
Go to the battle. See, we just hit continue and then it's just done. <laughs> the game's like, ooh, you're safe for now, but only for now. Okay. Employees needed. Oh, I just need people to hurry up and move in, man, is what I need. Taking the piss. Alright. Do a little roadblock there, actually. Okay, so we have like a shitload of everything. Just whenever the, the Emperor's gonna go ahead and request it. Oh, I tell you one thing I don't have, man. Why can't I build a pet? Oh, I do have a personal mansion. What am I talking about, man? Cool. Alright, so what do we need, man? We need educational facilities now, so I could start ordering in uh, Papyrus, right? I could start ordering that in, man. We could get a new Breeds. Um... Oh, for God's sake, okay. Which of you sells it, man? Just tell me. What? What? You buy papyrus. Who sells it, then? What is this? Am I missing something here? I can't move around on this world map, man. But see, the video game is telling me that I can open uh, trade routes to import or export Papyrus. But like, am I just fucking blind? Like, there's only three places here where I can open trade routes. Okay, I'm just gonna open it here and see what happens. Is that it? Can we do it? That's exportable. Okay, yeah, that's exactly the way I thought it was. Um, oh, we've already got that bloody route open. There's another one open. I'm just gonna open everything. But, like, nothing is gonna... Dude, I hit everything, man! Why is it telling me papyrus is fucking importable when it's just not? For God's sake. That's frustrating. Okay, you know what, man? I'm sick of these goddamn fools telling me that they don't have access to uh, healthcare. Even though we have like a trillion physicians all over the fucking place in the city. So there we go. That's what we're doing. Our population is growing as more people arrive and fill up the housing. Very nice. Cool, 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 cool. Very good. Okay, that's one of the victory conditions, right? So it's just our kingdom rating now that we need to uh, upgrade, I think. Yeah. Okay, dude. So we can boost our kingdom rating a bit by sending a gift to the Egyptian people, I think. Uh, Bedouin army will be here kind of soon. Got it. Sure. Cool. Um, Overseer of Commerce? How do I send a gift to the Egyptian people, man? Military Overseer, Overseer of Treasury. Seth just fucking loves us. He's just happy as Larry. Okay, I have no idea how I do this then. Oh. What did I just do? Why is my goddamn kingdom rating going down, dude? Send a gift. Libyan bodyguards. To the people of Egypt. Oh, there we go. We actually just gained five kingdom rating just from that. Send him a golden chariot too. That only give me one. Are you fucking kidding me? That's horrible. Not worth it. Yes, yes, yes. Many blessings. Very good. Okay, we just have so much cash now. This is not even funny. Um, <laughs> you don't have access to local religious facilities. Are you actually shitting me, dude? Like, this is what I mean, dude. Like, this is just, it's just fucking stupid. Um, 
But you're right next to a temple. It's right there, dude. He's like, oh, no, I haven't seen the priest. I ain't seen him, dude. Not upgrading. What a div. Pottery, game made weapons, bam. Instantly delivered those goods, dude. Instantly. How close are we now? This better be about to go up. I just sent you weapons instantly without any delay there, dude. Don't be an asshole now. I mean, I like, that's it, man. This mission's done. This mission's done. We won. We literally won, dude. There we go, man. Kingdom Standing Climbs. What, what are we at now? Six. I need 70. Okay, the Bedouins are going to attack again, but... We don't really care because we're just going to annihilate them with stupendous force. I mean, look at them. What are they doing, man? Wrecked. Gone. Okay. I'll pause this one for a little while, man. We're just kind of playing the waiting game now, so... Oh, unpausing almost immediately. Pharaoh uh, requests, what, cash? That's it. That's all he wants. 1.1k, dude. Done. Kingdom standing going to climb again, right? Come on, let me see it go up. We're on 60 right now. Dude. Dude. Why isn't it going up? Oh, there we go. We only gained four. Like, this is what I'm talking about, man. We can fulfill any request instantly, so I might as well sort of skip ahead a little bit, you know? The palace has been robbed. What heathens are robbing the... Why do we still have 20% unemployment? Oh, for God's sake. Okay, man, let me fix this. All right. Delivering more weapons. Bam. Handled instantly. This might be it, man. This might be it, boys. We'll see. We'll see, man. I'm going to pay myself less of a salary as well because I've heard that that can also increase your kingdom rating. Like, make people think, Oh, look, man, look. He's barely even drawing a salary, dude. He's just, you know... He just, he's just doing it for the Egyptian people and all that shit. Okay, did we get it? Did we get it? Dude, we gained like fucking nothing. Oh my god, man. Can you just ask me for more gifts, please? I have everything here, dude. We're so fucking rich. God damn it. Holy shit. Okay, we just sent a generous gift to Egypt and we hit 70. <laughs> I don't think I gained 5 uh, kingdom rating from just clicking on this, but... Nice, okay. This might have actually just pushed, pushed us over to the edge immediately, right? Hey! Victory. We did it. Cool. Alright, man. Feels good. Alright, man. Seems like a pretty good spot to leave off this episode here, man. Feels good. I'm pretty sure that we have a lot of monument building to do in this next one, so we'll see how that pans out. Now, thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you all enjoyed. Make sure to like, subscribe, all of that good stuff. If you did, so you don't miss the future videos. And yeah. Catch you guys a tad bit later.